Last episode, we got 81 woodcutting as we finished chopping all the willows we needed for our 75 fletching grind. I know we're still waiting uh, for a maze random to hopefully get some feathers to make our rune arrow finally officially, but at least we got a use shield. That fletching grind, of course, was the last thing that we needed to unlock this chunk and this chunk. We got new fletching grinds, new hunter grind, new combat grinds, a whole bunch of fun stuff to look forward to. Got our first net, got our first jars, and we even already upgraded our bronze axe. So I went ahead and added uh, catching a lucky impling to the chunk picker website. It updated my tasks and we've got damn near 40 tasks now, which I can't even begin to tell you how excited I am to finally get into this and just have like a whole wide range of things to do. I mean, off rip, I'm already looking at that 95 cooking. The fact that you need 95 cooking to put a strawberry into a pie dish. Uh, it's only gonna take me like a little under 25,000 more lobsters. So, you know, that's a grind we're familiar with. I showed a little bit of Piro Piro last episode, but the majority of these tasks that we have outside of like fletching our magic short bow, fletching our magic shield, our rune arrows, and uh, burning our magic log. The majority of these are just loot from, you know, random implings as we keep leveling up our hunter. A lot of these tasks are gonna be pretty easy. Uh, 40 attack, 40 strength. We already have 40 defense, 60 range, uh, 40 magic, you know. And then there's some that I'm like, how the hell am I supposed to get that? Like 43 crafting, uh, I, you know, I gotta look into that, but I don't know how I'm supposed to do that. Um, and then my real biggest question mark is what magic level do we get? Because ninja implings drop onyx bolts and I would need 87 magic to enchant those. But dragon implings drop dragon stone bolts and I would only need 68 magic to enchant those. So of course, you know, we find ourselves in a little predicament. Um, it's like a 20 level difference. So that's pretty big, man. Um, I don't exactly know, you know, how many implings I'll catch when this is all said and done, but there is a chance that we have enough runes to get 87 uh, from everything combined. So, you know, there is a possibility, but I would love to ask you guys what you think, um, you know, I should do. You know, I definitely value you guys' opinion for sure. I love when I get to use a new soundtrack in one of the videos man this one's a banger although i don't know how often we'll be over here chopping these because even though we got this axe upgrade these things are still slow as shit like slower than the willows with the bronze like i'm doing one inventory and that's it this definitely took like 25 minutes by the way all right 28 hunter we can catch gourmet implings now and uh that's where we get the strawberries from I really should be catching more baby implings because, dude, we're gonna need, I don't even know how many jars, probably like a hundred thousand or some shit, but I, you know, I can't be bothered to stack the young implings and just, you know, I like opening them as I go. I'm trying to see how many bowstring we stack up. And quite frankly, I'm just really enjoying watching all the new items come in. We're gonna have a killer loot tab and this is just the start of it. Nah, see the, the Yu longbow? I wouldn't have been able to make one of these. Let's see if we get anything else interesting. Back to back you longbows. First oak plank. We're gonna get that stack started early then uh, while we wait to get eclectic implings, but all right, not bad. About to see what this first gourmet, not the tuna bro, for real. I don't even have any like I'm pretty sure I just like got rid of them so any cooked tuna that we have on Dr. Pepper now are gonna be from implings. After this one uh, we have one more bowstring saved for our magic short bow and then we're saving all the rest uh, for our magic long bows. I have been cutting used too. Uh, we got our first a thousand now. Um, we need 10,300 use to get from 75 fletching to 80 to make our magic short bow. I don't know if I'm going to cut use all the way to uh, 87 fletching. Um, I might switch it up to willows just depending on how slow it ends up being, but I've really been enjoying chopping these use with the steel axe. You're welcome, bro. Give me that lamp. 
Thank you. This is going to be the first one that we put into smithing because I still want to make that mithril axe. And we should have got it there, but one more log until 82 wood cutting. Oh, there it is. Very fast. 82 wood cutting. Very nice. Very nice. I think at the end of our 87 fletching grind, we should have around 94 and 95 wood cutting. Like, just get 99 at that point. First grubby key on the account. That's interesting, because, uh, you know, we could get to Zaya soon. You know, who knows? A little Hasidious action. Chef's Delight. Plus five cooking boost. Bro, we can literally make the part summer pie. Yes, sir. And there is level 30, Hunter. Just thank you. Yes, yes. Keep giving me all the bowstring. I need all the bowstring. The oog, the oog thonk, oog. Th How do you say that? Shout out to my guy, the cube. My man just came through, pulled up, dropped off two bonds for me. My man, I appreciate it. Thank you so much, and welcome to the Cozy Boys clan. And of course, the James cameo. My boy, been working on the mahogany homes I see. Pulled up in the full construction fit. Yeah, yeah, caught your ass. 33 Hunter. Ooh. Ooh. The full inventories are so satisfying. And we're stacking these things up, man. 75 gourmet implings. A quarter mil right there. 233k pretty much. That's pretty good. I don't care. I'm opening these. I'm in the mood to stack some loot. And I'm in the mood to see how many easy clues we can get. See if we can get a step that we can do. Or if we're just going to drop a bunch. That first clue casket is going to go crazy, man. This shit is tough. Ooh. And there is 34 Hunter, just two levels away now from Earth Implings. Easy clue from the Young Impling. Of course. Fucking, bro, Falador every time, dude. Fish pie. Huh. Plus three fishing boosts right there. And then another one. Wow, just like that. Just four more, you know, easy clues tossed away with the rest of them. Bro, we might have we might have dropped like ten this episode already. We're having just horrible luck with the easy clues. Got another little milestone coming in with this inventory. That is two thousand U logs banked. Just give me the mystery box, bro. I'm busy, man. What do we got? What do we got? Body rune. Our first body rune. 
Lovely. There we go. Level 35 hunter. Oh man, I wish we could do aerial fishing. I really wish we could. But uh, on the bright side, just one more level till earth implings. Ooh, some rainbow fish. Very cool. Clue, okay. Ver Bro, if it's not Falador, it's Varrock now, I swear. Got another woodcutting level coming in. 83 wood cutting, just chipping away. It happened, it happened, it happened. We got our red egg. We got all three now. Now I don't have to worry about it anymore. Hell yeah. Put this in the bizank. Clear that bank filler. Man, we've been waiting a long time for that. Ah, oh, that looks great. And 170 bird's nests. I can't wait until we can catch one of these, bro. Level 36 hunter. The earth impling has officially been unlocked now. Bro, whole new impling, whole new loot table. I mean, I'm excited. Let's see if we can catch one. Ooh. Ooh. Hell yeah. Bro, we got so many earth implings. All right, the first earth implings on the account. I got my medium clue step that we already have. The flax field. So I'm going to drop it while we try to juggle. You know, let's just see what we get. There is level 37 Hunter, just five levels away from Essence Simplings. Ugh. See, now Varrock's on my shit list. All right, let's see. Let's see if we got anything new this time around. Look at the sand, fire talisman, the Hairlander seeds. Okay, no herb patch, but you know, something new. Super compost. All right, that's pretty cool. And there is level 38 hunter. Another day, another easy clue I can't do. Holy sea bass, bro. Oh shit. What is it? Lumberyard. Varrock, dude. Every time. <laughs> no comment. No comment. What is it? What is it? Zaya can't go there. Another mystery box. 20 nature runes. All right. For the second time. Got another one. Camelot Castle. Dude, I've had this step. I dropped it. Wow. One chunk away. That sucks. And not even 10 seconds later. Parparian Village. <laughs> another one. Where now? Bro, the fishing guild one again. Oh my god. Look at all my clues on the ground. Like, we're turning Catherby Bank into a easy clue graveyard. This inventory right here is going to get us 3,000 U logs banked already, man. There is level 39 Hunter. Three levels away now. And got a big level coming in. There is level 40 Hunter. Just two levels away now. Bro, I cannot wait to have this thing. Got another clue. The Toad and Chicken Pub. Ah. 
I'm not really getting any medium clues uh, from the Earth Implings. Um, I know I can't really expect it because the Essences and the Eclectics drop them uh, more frequently, but, you know, I'm, I'm happy with how the loot is coming along, man. We got a lot of shit already. Like, bro, 57 bowstring. Sears Village. Damn, dude, that's one of the closer ones. Where is that? One chunk away, again. Bruh, are you serious? How am I supposed to get this man? Oh. Alright, never mind. Another clue nest. But we're getting a lot of these. And by a lot, I mean like three. But, what do we get? The Falador party room. It's so typical. And we get another one. So, what do we get? Falador, dude. You know, you miss so many. Sometimes you need to just catch a baby impling. 41 Hunter. One level away from unlocking the magic skill. Like, it's just huge. Look at this guy, man. I want to catch him so bad. So bad. Look at the number of Earths and Gourmets we got. We got 80 of each, man. The biggest level of the chunk so far, level 42 hunter, this is huge. We got essence emblings, we got the magic butterfly net, and we got air runes, which means we've officially unlocked the magic skill. Missed our first one, but that's okay because I have proof in the chat box that we caught it, and there's video evidence that we caught our second one, and we didn't even upgrade our net yet until now, because it's time. Let me uh, select the right one, confirm my magic butterfly net, <laughs> and there we have it. Throwing it over my shoulder. Look at that, man. Come on, we gotta see what we get from our first essence sibling. Blood runes, all right. Yeah, that's cool. I'll take all the blood runes. Another inventory of you logs. 4,000 banked now and there is 84 woodcutting coming in some of these levels are getting up there man this is where our stats are leaving off 635 total with plenty more levels on the way trust me we got two tasks on this episode, making the part summer pie and the diary task for catching an essence sampling in Piro Piro. We got a lot of good progress done this episode. 4,000 new logs, only 6,000 more until we get our magic short bow. And then let us get our first air runes, bro. Those ice giants are going to be shaking in their boots.